Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be talking about how to balance work and your side business. Are you trying to find the time to balance your side business? And when I say that, I mean like, if you have a part-time or full-time job that you do not want to do for the rest of your life, and you are looking for something that you want to pursue that you actually like doing and get paid at doing, you need the time, energy, effort, consistency. You need all of that mixed up in a pot in order to be successful in your side business where you are getting paid to live your dream okay so in order to do that keep watching this video now if you're new to my channel my name is taylor i am a life coach and i help encourage and empower people to live authentically through positive self-awareness okay and also know that i do one-on-one -on -one coaching and if you would like a call with me please go ahead and send me an email that way you can schedule an appointment to see if we are a good fit look at how your schedule is right now and when i say schedule i mean when you wake up before you go to work, after work, before you go to bed. So the first part is when you wake up. When you wake up, it could be personal hygiene, you get your coffee or your tea, maybe do some yoga, um, go to the gym, whatever that may look like for you as far as your morning routine goes. And then before you go to work, what do you do before you go to work? Are you rushing in the morning, trying to make sure you get to work on time? Be figure out what is going on in the morning so that way you can make that time not lose time make that time okay and then during work the reason why i say during work is because you have lunch so if it's an hour perfect that first half an hour you can eat your lunch the second half of your lunch you could spend that extra 30 minutes on your actual business okay and then if you have a 30 minute lunch that's different and it's really up to that person if they want to do like 15 minute lunch and then the other 15 on their business it's really up to you and are you able to make that time i'm not saying to work your entire lunch it's super important for you to make sure you get that lunch break in make sure that you guys are definitely taking care of yourselves while balancing work and your business because that is a lot of energy that it takes to definitely balance try to balance both and then there is after work what are you doing right after work are you going to the gym are you just um are you laying on the bed for a few minutes are you watching tv catching up on shows what are you doing after work then what are you doing before bed what are you doing before you go to bed do you meditate do you um, do you watch TV until you fall asleep? You know your routine. You know yourself. So I would definitely take the time to figure out what's your routine looking like every day. Maybe your routine changes. Rough estimate as far as what your routine will look like each day. Like what are some things that are consistent? What are some things you do every single day that you know when you wake up and when before you go to work during these times that I said, what are you doing? And the next thing you'll do is write down everything that you do for your business. That way you're looking at all of the tasks that you want to complete for your work. And with that being said, next to each thing, write down how long does it take to finish each task. Those times are very important to know when you are trying to figure out how long each thing is going to take because you are trying to implement those times into the daily schedule that you already have. That is the whole purpose of this. So putting it together, once you have the list of the tasks that you do for your side business and also the times you try to find a way to merge it into your daily routine already so maybe some of the things that you have in your daily routine you don't even want to do anymore you know maybe you feel like it's a waste of time however that may look like for you when it comes to time management it takes baby steps in order to actually see results okay it may not necessarily happen overnight some things you may not be able to finish or may not have time for you're trying to add something new to what you already are used to and you're bound to make mistakes but you're also bound to grow and actually adapt to your new schedule personal experience though what i want to share is time management was definitely one of my biggest things that i've been struggling with and setting time aside into my business instead of just kind of going with the flow through each day, trying to make time for my business whenever it's possible. Especially if you're working a job. 
and you get home, you're probably gonna be tired and not gonna wanna do anything. You're gonna wanna procrastinate, at least I did. You know, I shut down because there's so much work that I felt like I had to do for the business. So I just wouldn't do anything sometimes. And I just would go to sleep or I would do something else to distract me and procrastinate, procrastinate, procrastinate. And guess what happens when you procrastinate? When you do something, you're getting, you're making some type of progress. It may not be skyrocketed up to being able to be a millionaire the next day. However, you're actually taking the baby steps to get there. That is all that I have for you today. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more content. And also, peep the new video. Video, peep the new video. Video, peep the new video.